In this video on systematic theology, we are looking at seven symbols used to illustrate the Word of God. This is part two of a four-part mini-series, Understanding the Bible. We're glad you could join us. God bless you. If you have not watched part one in this series, you can watch it right now and then come back to this video. The link to part one is in the top right corner and also in the description section below. Let's get into it. Number one, the Word of God has been symbolized as a sword. The Bible is a sword that convicts the hearer. Read with me Hebrews 4 verse 12. For the Word of God is alive and active, sharper than any double-edged sword. It penetrates even to dividing soul and spirit, joints and marrow. It judges the thoughts and attitudes of the heart. Symbol number two that has been used is a hammer. The Bible is powerful and breaks the resistance of the hearer. Jeremiah 23 verse 29, the Lord declares, Is not my word like fire and like a hammer that breaks a rock in pieces? The third symbol that has been used to illustrate the word of God is a seed. The Bible is a living word that serves a purpose in regenerating the hearer. 1 Peter chapter 1 and verse 23 states as follows. For you have been born again, not of perishable seed, but of imperishable, through the living and enduring Word of God. The fourth symbol is a mirror. The Bible is a faithful word that reveals an individual to himself. James 1 verses 23 to 25 reveal the following. Anyone who listens to the word but does not do what it says is like someone who looks at his face in a mirror and after looking at him goes away and immediately forgets what he looks like. But whoever looks intently into the perfect law that gives freedom and continues in it, not forgetting what they have heard but doing it, they will be blessed in what they do. Before we proceed into symbol number five, if you haven't already, subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell down below. Remember to like this video and help us spread the word. Liking helps us with the algorithm so that YouTube will show this video to more people. Moving on, symbol number five is fire. The Bible is a burning word, the consuming dross in the hearer. Jeremiah 23 verse 29 reads, Is not my word like fire, declares the Lord, and like a hammer that breaks a rock into pieces? Number six, a lamp has been used to illustrate the Word of God. The Bible is an illuminating word guiding the believers day by day. This can be seen in Psalms 119 verse 105, which states, The Word is a lamp unto my feet and light unto my path. Last but not least, the Word of God has been symbolized by food. The Bible is nourishing food, feeding the soul of believers. 1 Peter chapter 2, verses 2 and 3 state, Like newborn babies crave spiritual milk, so that by it you may grow up in your salvation, now that you have tasted that the Lord is good. We have seen that the Word of God convicts, breaks, regenerates, reveals, consumes, illuminates, and nourishes us. This has been part two in the series Understanding the Bible. We welcome you to watch part three coming up on your screen right now. Take care and God bless.